Hey guys, this is Will Horner from Train Guard Jiu Jitsu and MMA with my student Andy here, and we're going to show you some moves from the uh, reverse Tel Heva guard. Alright, here we go. Go on, come on, let's go. Alright, look. So, first, a lot of times when a guy is trying to pass knee through the middle, I like to go to a, kind of like a reverse Tel Heva. The best way to explain this is that if my knees are facing to the right here, that's kind of what he wants in order to, to pass my guard. So, what I want to do as a principle is I want to step and turn my hips the opposite way, all right? So as long as my knees are facing this way, I'm gonna hook behind his thigh with my right leg, my right foot, and I'm gonna hook his ankle with my, my left calf here, and I'm creating pressure this way that makes it very difficult for him to try to pass my guard. Go here. Right, look at this. So as soon as he starts coming in, I go over here. Foot hooks behind, knee on knee, pressing to the left like this. I like to also hold his ankle with my left hand. So go like this. Keep the pressure to the left. Now, I'm probably not going to sweep him here, but that's not the sweep. The sweep's going to come when he starts coming in. I'm going to lock my feet together, just like this. And as he keeps putting his weight on me, my right hand's going to go in his armpit, like just like a stiff arm, like a punch. And I'm going to kick my legs. I'm going to scissor them right up, trying to lift high, low with my left. And I'm going to sweep him to the left. And finish the pass, knees in the middle, whatever way you want to do it. Again. So I'm going to be here. I go to the left. He starts coming in. Right hand is going to go to his armpit. Right foot hooking behind his thigh. And a big, powerful scissor. Make sure you're lifting him with your right leg as you're scissoring. And then just follow with the knees in the middle. Or you can cover with half guard, whatever you want. Again. Let's do it this way. So he comes in, my, left, my right leg's in a plant, I'm going to turn my hips this way. Make sure you have a good strong hook and initially with that right foot in order to bring your right knee into his knee. Now as he continues to press, make sure you grab his ankle, keep coming in. I'm going to grab with my right hand on his armpit and I'm going to scissor, watch my legs, and get up and take the pass. Alright guys, if you have any questions, email us at www.free30daymma.com. And I don't know what else to say. <laughs> Let me try that again. <laughs>